All right, so here's the deal. The gunman, there was a an armed man in a ski mask, an armed man in a ski mask. Uh, unbelievable here, okay? And don't forget to get your tickets for the <laughs> aliens among us, that's for sure. Don't miss out on this webinar. But this armed man with a ski mask was arrested while approaching the Republican National Convention perimeter in Milwaukee last night. He had an AK-47 pistol, uh, wearing a ski mask with a tactical bag full with a full magazine. According to Fox News Flash top headlines, a man armed with an AK-47 pistol wearing a ski mask was arrested uh, just blocks from the Republican National Convention that's being held in Milwaukee, Wisconsin, according to federal law enforcement officials. Homeland Security investigators and Capitol Police were conducting surveillances near the Republican National Convention perimeter when they noticed a suspicious man approaching. He was wearing a ski mask, carrying a tactical bag, according to Fox News. They have confirmed this. Inside the bag, police found a gun and a full magazine. His intentions are still unclear. Milwaukee police confirmed the incident with Fox News, saying that this was a 21-year-old man who was arrested at about 1 p.m. in the afternoon. Police said the man does not have a concealed weapon license in Wisconsin or any other state. So, see, he can't have it concealed like that. Charges are pending review by, of course, the Milwaukee County District's Attorney. Fox News reached out to the Secret Service about this incident and was referred to the Milwaukee police. Fox News also reached out to the Homeland Security investigators and investigations and the Department of Homeland Security, but they have not heard back from them. This is not the only disturbing security concern to take place because another man uh, yesterday was shot and killed by police two miles from the forum uh, witnesses say the man lived in a nearby homeless camp and was brandishing a knife. Uh, and we don't know what all he was shouting and saying, but he was shot. According to the report, also yesterday, Derek Van Orden, he is a congressman from Minnesota, a Republican congressman from Minnesota. He was assaulted by a protester uh that was said they was a member of Code Pink, assaulted him while he was waiting in line to enter the venue at the convention center. He called it an incident of political violence. Now, Code Pink said the woman was intentionally bumped into by this bald white member of Congress while he tried to shove her past her. The activist group denies that Orden was assaulted. 